Hello, welcome to Wasteland 3 and Major Tomcat. Look at him, he's so cute. And he's purring. Okay, Ranger, let's get back to the mission. Now, we looted every part of this area, we lost a few good men and, well... Now, the game actually expects you to play the game all over again with some first aid skill and some other stuff so you can get all the extra stuff. A med high point, some... First aid, okay, that's nice. Now, the major problem is that the game really wants you to play it a certain way. We finally have enough ammo for him. So, let's go to the base. Wow, this is a beautiful machine. Okay, let's get out of here. We wasted enough time. Was that Major Brassad? They got her? God damn it. Fuck this place. Fuck it. <laughs> she finally decided to come with us. Well, we saved one soldier. I guess that's better than, uh, you know, losing everyone in the entire squad. Th that would have been horrible to report. So now when they ask us, are there survivors? Yes. Good. How many? And we will say we found a base. We'll give you a more detailed report later. <laughs> How do we proceed? You know, change the subject very quickly. Now, I like a lot of things about the game and I didn't play it because I didn't have time. I wanted to take a break from YouTube uh, during the weekend for one day. Because I wanted also to play more of the new world because, hey, if you hate something, you have to have a good reason to hate it, right? And I'll be doing more, uh, more stuff on Remnant and some other things near... I mean, next week I'll be doing some more stuff. I don't think we have any major releases coming up soon, anyway. Welcome, Rangers. You may approach the Patriot. Colorado Springs. <laughs> Listen to that beast. Three. 50. When there were fifty. Cold logic says I should turn you away. That there aren't enough of you left to do the job at hand. But that Dorsey ambush was my fault and i owe you more than explanations and apologies so here's something more tangible the dorseys didn't just attack you they attacked my city this one was trying to burn down our jail if you want some vengeance for what was done to you He's yours. <laughs> nice shoulder guards. Kill him. Leadership. Well, um, I wish I had the leadership, but no. Well, he's your prisoner. I don't want to kill anyone. If you insist. Hey, Thank at least you. use a gun. It's been too long since I've dealt with my problems firsthand. I'd like to do the same to all the Dorseys. And maybe, with your help, I will. But for now, let me address your immediate needs. In addition to this base and the aid I promised your general, I'll be giving you the resources to return your force to full strength. Recruiting, training, and equipping. It's not enough, I know. The men and women you lost can never be replaced, but it's what I can give you. I hope you'll accept it. Well, can we refuse it and turn back? Oh, okay. Well, I guess you would have given us more stuff. Ah, thank you. I'm glad to find you so amenable. I hope that means we're going to get along. Now. <sighs> Introductions. My name is Saul Buchanan. I own Colorado, though you'll meet some who disagree. This base is your new home. From here, you'll aid my people and, more importantly, do the job I brought you here to do. Now, 
Yes, Joe. Pardon, Patriarch. It's Daisy. An update on the Garden of the Gods? All right. Sorry, Rangers. Still putting out fires. Two of my best are waiting for you inside. Darius Kwan of the Marshals and my old friend Sergei Gretzky. Go see him. I'll be in when I'm done here. Did you see that his hammer is made out of uh, giant fists? Also a lot of American symbols. Anyway, this is what I like to see. Adamant, Elite Enforcer, Elite Guard. They have pretty cool armors. By the way, this is a power armor because it has also the legs. And okay, let's just skip Not this part. Me come down there. What? Immaculate? So they are named characters? That's a minigun. Okay, I don't think we have anything to inspect outside. I mean, it would be cruel for them to put something outside, right? <laughs> anyway, let's play with our cat in the snow for a little bit. Why? Oh, okay, let's pick with the cyborg chicken. Sense of loneliness in its eyes. Cluck. In a fight with a brick? But I don't get it. Uh, yeah, whatever. I should have read the last one, the field stripping. I'll read it <laughs> on the video. But I have animal uh, whisperer. He should say something to me. Well, at least I have one level. Or don't I have Animal Whisperer? Huh. Okay, let's look at this again, because sometimes the game is not really clear on what they want you to do. What is done about? Ah, uh, forget it. I guess we need level 3 or something like that. Can we look at his home? No, nothing special over there, but why is there a cyborg chicken? Doggies, come on. Oh, okay, we can loot some stuff from here. Very fight tar, well, that's nice. Also, a lot of bullets, okay, it was worth it. Oh, okay, so I need Animal Whisper level 3 to unlock whatever they are doing over there. Well, I guess we can take a dog with us in our adventures, but I don't want them to be killed. Ah, the phone, I hate it. Rad Tech. Okay, it looks like uh, there was a mine over here. A mine over here. I need to give someone explosives, otherwise this would not work. Ah, he'll be fine. Armor plus four is basically the same. Oh, it's actually a lot heavier. What? When did I pick up this hat? I don't know. I'm a bit lost right now. Anyway, this element really looks cool. Unplaceable um, smell. Well, you know, a little smell never hurt anyone. But this is not... This is not an armor piece. Well, I guess he can't really equip anything, and by anything he really means it. Okay, that was a nice little secret over there. Now I guess it's worth exploring a little more. 
Why would they put a mine over there? Ah, who knows? Maybe they, were, they just wanted to scare us. Okay, now let's go over here for a little bit. Yeah, I enjoy that they put cool stuff into the game like that. I could re reload and, you know... Skip. Oh, that's only a rabbit. I thought it was something more sinister. You know, I remember the first time I played Wasteland 2. I had to make my skills in such a way that everything was covered. So maybe I'll play this game a second time on Supreme Jork. But I'll cover my skills to what the game wants me to do to get all the endings, all the information and all the other stuff. I know the game is very popular, but sadly it's, this is a game also for streaming. It doesn't really work on YouTube, but I will still do it. Otherwise, I don't think I can justify the time to play it, sadly. So, let me think about this. I don't know what characters I'll get. Okay. Let's not do anything right now because I want to get. I want to see if we have NPCs and then we'll get the other. the other skills for our team. Not a chance. Damn it. Ah, whatever. Nothing really important. Also, I'm looking for digging spots. I don't know if we'll get a shovel and we might dig, but uh, anyway, let's go inside and check our base. It's probably a lot nicer inside. Hey, Welcome, you. Welcome, Rangers. I'm Marshal Darius Kwan, and this here is Sergei Gretzky. Good to meet you, Rangers. Glad to see some friendly faces. Been rough around here these last few days. Dorsey's attacked us, too. Snuck inside Colorado Springs and killed a lot of people. Situation's under control now. Mostly. No idea. Something must have triggered the old security system. Trouble is, there's a bunch of angry robots guarding the computer that shuts them off. How you deal with them is your call. Your base. Your rules. Yeah, weird, huh? They weren't active when we looked the place over a few days back, but... Ah, let's talk after you kill... I can hardly hear myself think. Oh, and this is a mission right now. Come on, big Don't helmet. Make me come down there. Well, I guess they, it would have been too easy if we just got the base as it is. <laughs> what a pile of junk. Okay, now let's see, how can we heal someone else? Pacified. He says, well, I don't have that one. Where, why is the sneak? Oh, so this one is actually like a sneaky ass. Hard ass, sneaky ass. Okay, I understand sneaky. Hey, these guys look like Wally or the thing for um, Circuit. Circuit, if you remember that movie with the robot. Slip show. Sir, 
Oh, they are harmless. I don't want to destroy them or kill them. Oh, we are supposed to stop the alarm. Eh, let's just loot a little more. Hey, where is... Oh, Major Tomcat is over here. Exactly what I expected. <laughs> Merc armor, okay. <laughs> well, I guess we can find the full set for him, but not for us, sadly. Six armor. Powerhouse. Yeah. So now we have the full red tech set. Again, I think the game grows too much in power in the beginning. They should have kept it like Wasteland 2 or a bunch of recruits, you know. Getting your bearings, not having armor, not having uh, weapons, not having anything. But now, look at this guy. He has the probably end game armor on him. I doubt it will be something much better we can get until, uh, I don't know, let's say 20 hours in. Full armor. Well, if we find a mine, he can actually survive stepping on it. So that's another great idea. Exo ni. The star cannot be removed. I actually I like all the options that we get, but I hope. I hope uh, we get more. Uh, more uh, characters that we can customize because this game is a lot about skills and eh, no way I enjoy it. Command is empty. I am command. I guess we are well the done, leaders. Rangers. Good to see the place up and running. <laughs> now, where were we? Oh yes, the reason you're here. As you may know, I have a daughter and two sons. Liberty, Valor, and Victory. Two of them conspired against me, and the third blackens the Buchanan name with every breath he takes. Consequently, I banished him. Well, we don't listen to those They've been skulking names. in the shadows ever since, but lately there's been rumors that I'm on my last legs. Lies, of course. But apparently my dear children believe them, and they've started making new plans. Assassins, emissaries? Eh, peace. peace. <laughs> With those brats, you'd sooner tame a scorpion. Looks like they have his blood. <laughs> I'm not worried about my children defeating me, rangers. They won't. Not even liberty. What worries me is the destruction they'll wreak as they fail. They'll tear my land and my people to shreds. They'll burn everything I've accomplished to ash. That's why they have to be stopped before they can start. That's why you, Rangers, have to find them and bring them home to me ASAP. And when I say bring them home, I mean bring them home alive. They're my blood. Kill them and we'll have a problem. Do I make myself clear? Well, I'm pretty sure we'll, we will kill at least two of them because he said that. You've already done the impossible by making it here. I trust you. Find a way to make it possible. Now, let me tell you where they are. Victories hold up in Aspen. Valor's under the protection of the Gippers in Denver. 
and Liberty's raising an army against me somewhere out on the Eastern Plains. Anything else you need to know? No barter, okay. What do you want to know? Oh, this would be a long dialogue, okay. What call Liberty? Liberty's got more brains and cunning than both her brothers put together. She's the only one who could actually run Colorado. Problem is, she'd run it as a goddamn slave state. Everyone in chains, everyone working for her. Wouldn't worry about her for now, though. Best to wait until you got a little more firepower. She's gonna be well protected. At least I raised one. Hmm. Boy's never been right in the head. Since he was a baby, he'd torture cats, terrorize the servants, set the house on fire, and he's only got worse. The things he's done to the women he finds. Anyway, I finally had enough and put the little monster under house arrest up in Aspen. I guess they weren't prepared because he escaped a while ago and then came back with a gang of freaks and turned the place into a slaughterhouse. Now he's on the radio, laughing about what he's going to do to his hostages and daring me to come after him. He, uh, claims he's captured some rangers as well. Don't get your hopes up. Vic likes to play with hostages. Might not be much left by the time you find them. <sighs> Soft, spoiled, fiddled with computers all day instead of learning the arts of diplomacy and war. Finally packed him off when he accidentally crashed my security systems right before his sister's little coup attempt. Made him my official ambassador to the Gippers, hoping he'd do to their systems what he'd done to mine. That was a mistake. He took his revenge by convincing them to cut off oil shipments to my city. No oil means no heat, no light, and no food for my people. So getting Valor back and resuming oil shipments from the Gippers has to happen now. No, but the Gippers are tough and well-armed, and Denver's a death trap. Divided loyalty, that's why. I trust my guards, but they don't leave my side. Ever. Everybody else... Everybody else is making plans for when I'm gone. The Hundred Families, the Gippers, the Marshals... They're all out for themselves. And they know my kids would make good figureheads, give them some legitimacy. Oh, okay, so I understand, so... Any Coloradan I send to bring Vic, Val, and Libby back home might think they'll get a better deal elsewhere. But not you. I'm the only one who can save your people. Nobody else can get supplies to Arizona before they starve to death. Well, that's true. That's why it's you who's doing this. You've got the only loyalty that works. The loyalty of self-interest. You'd better. Anything else? Uh-huh. The last dregs of a treacherous family. Thought I'd wipe them out years ago, but... But what, you forget 10,000 of them? linger, Rangers. I know that better than most. Possibly. But I know the Dorseys from the old days. They don't take orders well. Then again, I wouldn't have guessed they'd have the guts to attack both you and Colorado Springs at the same time. So somebody put some fire in them. My staff and I coordinated the details of your arrival using coded transmissions on radio frequencies we thought were secure. Obviously, they were not. And you paid for it. I take full responsibility. Eh, what can we do about it now? Good. What else do you need? Well, nothing to barter. Okay, let's get on with it. Of course. 
Now, if you want a chance to impress me and maybe get a little payback, that call I got outside was from Sheriff Daisy, the head of the marshals in Colorado Springs. She's having trouble rousting some Dorseys who have been holed up in the Garden of the Gods since their raid fell apart. Why don't you go give her a hand? Show us what the Rangers can do. Enjoy yourselves, Rangers. All right, let's move out. I still think they made some mistakes with you being so strong in the beginning and also giving you a few free levels up. Well, I guess we are only two people at this moment. <laughs> okay, so now they leave us alone because I want to explore the base a little bit. Okay, I guess they are so nice. And this is a good time to end the video. See you next time. Bye.